Valor Fitness produces a number of squat stands, one of which is the BD-9 that you see here. The BD-9 comes as a pair, and they are not connected in any way like some of their other stands. The specs say that they are rated for 350 pounds, but if you're squatting or benching that much, you may want to have a spotter or go with a power cage because they don't have enough stability to handle a rough landing with a barbell that heavy. Even with 100 pounds of plates stacked on the bottom of each stand, I don't know that I would want to be benching much more than 200 pounds with this setup. That being said, this is a well-built piece of equipment, so let's take a closer look. These stands are adjustable from 48 inches up to as high as 70 inches, I believe, in 10 different uh, increments. Of course, this is the part of the stand that's going to hold the bar while you're doing squats. And the bar rests on that little ridge you see there. And it does come with a hook that you can use to keep your bar in place while you're changing plates. And these are the holes for the uh, 10, 10 different adjustments. And this is the catch for when you're doing bench press. I don't know that I would trust that for 350 pounds, but I think you can get well over 200 pounds uh, on these hooks. And that is the spotter arm. And of course the adjustment on the back. And each stand comes with a safety pin, so make sure you use the safety pins in addition to the uh, dials on the back. This is for plate storage, so it'll hold standard or Olympic plates. I typically kept 100 pounds on each stand just to keep it stable. And then you can see that the depth of each stand is adjustable with those four bolts right there. And there's the adjustment knob. Very easy to use. And it tightens down nice and tight. Let's take a look at the finish on this. Very nice finish all the way around. If you're keeping this outside or in a garage, I don't think you're going to have much problem with rust. Again, the safety pin and the knob for the safety arms. And you'll notice here, the back cross member is wider than the front cross member to provide you with additional stability. Again, the depth of these is adjustable. So depending on your workspace, how you're setting up your bench, how you like to set up your squat, um, it's adjustable enough that you can move these in and out for those purposes. I picked up these stands online for between $170 and $180 earlier this year, which is a pretty good value for a set of stands this quality. Well, I hope you found this video useful. If you did, please press like and share with your friends. If you're not already a subscriber, I would love to have you as a subscriber. And as always, good luck with your fitness. Thank you.